Hola everybody and thank you so much for stopping by my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lisa and welcome to Our Gray House. I share DIY videos every Tuesday and Friday and I sprinkle other videos in between. If you're into inspiration for like home decor, travel, food, fashion, beauty, all on a budget, you're in the right spot. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell for notifications. You guys know what to do. Let's just get into the video. For this project, you'll need a charger plate. I just got mine from the Dollar Tree. You need a hot glue gun and some glue stick. You will need some cord or jute or twine. So for this project, I'm letting the glue gun, the almighty glue gun heat up here. I don't have a, I need a stand for it. I'm gonna make a stand. I'm just looking for a business card holder. Cause I saw one, I saw somebody do one online and I, anyway, I'm gonna make myself a stand, but that's another project for another day. This is just a charger plate that I got from the Dollar Tree. It's black on the other side, so that's fantastic because that's what color I wanted it. And then I'm just going to be doing the, um, just wrapping rope around. <laughs> it's really not that hard, y'all. So, but I do need to find the center just to make sure I'm kind of starting where I need to start. I am not super exacto type person, but we're just gonna kind of gauge it a little bit. I should be a super exacto type person, just not. How are we gonna mark this? I'm just kind of marking the center point there, and then I'll mark the center point here. So I need to start right about here. That looks centerish to me. So what I thought I would do would be to put a little dab of glue and kind of like just start it like that. So I have like a little starting point. Now you couldn't really see that, but whatever. So I'm gonna put a little bit of glue here. There's a good chance I'm gonna burn myself. I try not to, or I'll just glue my fingers together. See, I wanted to kind of start out like that. Here, I got a different idea. I'm gonna glue right, put some glue right here, then I'm gonna bend it like that. And I'm just cut off this back end in a second here. That didn't work at all. It didn't even like stick together. Maybe this project ain't gonna work, y'all. Maybe it's gonna be a fail before we even start. Cause like the idea is I'm gonna, then I'll just cut off the rest and then I'll glue it down and then start going around in a circle. That's my idea anyway. I saw this one gal, she had on like a silicone glove so that she wouldn't get burnt from the hot glue. I thought that was clever. So I'm gonna hold that like that, <laughs> see if this works. If not, we're gonna have to go to plan B, which I do not have at plan B. I want that much glue showing at the top right there. See, we're already getting a mess on the plate. We don't need a mess on the plate. I'm just gonna keep squeezing together, but I'm gonna trim off this little end here, trying to get it. I know this is what y'all came here for. <laughs> Let's watch Lisa try to, there we go, try to trim off some cord. Oh, that's not making a mess. So now it seems to be sort of sticking together, although, I, hello, somebody just went past my house. Okay, it seems to be sticking together, kind of. I don't think this going, I don't know if it's gonna work. I'm gonna be positive. I'm gonna put a pretty generous mound of glue right here and poke this in the middle. Then, kind of start to wrap it around. Ouch! Okay, well that's staying. Now I just gotta wrap it all the way around the plate. I want a decent amount of glue, but not so much that it's oozing everywhere. Cause I don't want it looking clumpy. Trying to hold it down just to keep it in place. And we've got low battery alert. Yes. Back in action with loading on up some more hot glue. You know, it's at the part where the hot glue don't need the hot glue quite yet, but it also kind of needs the hot glue anyway. Add a little bit more glue and just careful. I'm trying to take my time with it, so I'm not putting too much glue and, you know, just so it looks nice. And I'm holding it in place, pressing down, trying to be careful. This is actually really, I was worried it wasn't gonna work out. It's working out. It's a real easy idea to do. You can get nautical rope from most Dollar Trees. I don't know how I'm gonna fix that because I'm like done, I'm at the edge here and I still could do like at least two more rows on this side. I don't know how I'm gonna fix this y'all. May have to wait for Marvin to come help me. I got the whole plate covered, but as you can see, maybe you can't, but I'm gonna point it out. On this side right here, it's not covering the silver and on this side it is. So I'm going to attempt to kind of cut this at an angle. Oh wait, maybe I should do the angle this way. The reason I'm cutting it at, as an, at an angle is I'm hoping to taper it and then just kind of tuck it under the, the charger plate and then maybe fix the other side by adding a little bit more to that one side. Okay, I don't know if you can see, but it's got a little bit of a 
pointed edge. You can't really see. That's okay. It's gonna work. It's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna put some glue here and go just a little bit to the back. Perfect. I mean, you can kind of tell where it was. So I'm gonna try to do another line of rope right here, but just that length, and try to do the same thing, taper off, that I got a little off when I started. It's okay. Try to do the same thing with the tapering of the cutting. Here's a little piece of twine that I'm going, going to try to attach right here and fix this little, little section. I'm gonna let this set for a while and then I'm gonna come back later, probably tomorrow, and to take my lighter and take off all the little fibers that are sticking up. Okay, so here's the deal. I was gonna kind of, this is the finished product. It looks fine just like this, kind of plain, but you know, whatever. And so I thought I'm gonna zhuzh it up and I'm gonna add like a little braided rope here at the corner. Yeah, so that didn't work out so well. The the glue didn't stick. I was even trying to use like E6000 glue. It was not sticking, it was not staying. So I thought, okay, well maybe I just need to do like a little, you know, like with this kind of material instead of trying to be all fancy with that. So that's what I'm gonna try now. I'm gonna try to glue down some, hot glue down some of the cord, the jute, the twine, whatever we're calling it. I don't know, but that's what I'm gonna try to do. And I just want like a little simple handle, nothing too, um, you know, like crazy or anything. Just like that. I thought that would just be just a good sign. So let me kind of measure that out. So now we're gonna put some, gonna attach the handles. Let's see if we can make this work. Put them right here kind of where I was doing the previous handle. Put that guy right down there, that guy right down there. Then I'm gonna get my sh little, these thingies to press it down because a while ago it got hot. So here it is finished. Like I said, the handles are just kind of eh. I don't know about those, but they're there for now and we'll be fine. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell for notifications, have an awesome day. I think that's about it. But if you wanna follow me on Instagram or YouTube, it's Our Gray House, but just don't follow me in real life though, because that's creepy. Bye.